If you are to give the same amount to the Ministry of Environment, the money will sink in. You cannot just throw money blindly. You will need to have an assessment of what are the likely vulnerable areas, what are the strategies that we could adopt as responses. We need an agency, uh, a commission in, in this case, that is, a, that is empowered and, have, and has an overview. You know, can see what is likely implication for this sector of the country, this sector of the country, and then coordinate responses. Just that quickly, you, you talked about channels of communication. What channels of communication would you recommend to get to the last man, even in rural areas? It's a whole system. Yeah, we, it, it, what your station is doing is vital. We need every other means. You know, sometimes when people want to pass funny information, they use social media and, you know, Things get very. We need to be able to coordinate the use of social media in a responsive way, so that people don't create unnecessary panic. We need to be able to use traditional media. We need to use a, a community associations, um, the town crier system, the school system. I mean, if you if we have all headmistresses, for instance, we have their phone numbers, and you can from the Ministry of Education pass an information that. You know, schools should not open tomorrow for this reason and that reason. Or even when schools had already started and you have wind that these things might happen, then you tell the administrator to take charge of children and probably not let them go home. Or some other things that we could do. We, we need this kind of system where you can get information to those who are empowered to act within the minute. Well, you know? uh, it's amazing, actually. Ni Simone here says, look, we don't even have the spread of basic weather instruments across the country. One of the reasons why our forecast may not be accurate and interpreting all of these wind vanes for the man out there, they need yeah. to understand some of yeah. these things yeah. to respond to it. But yeah. it really just goes a lot, uh, yeah, leaves a lot to be desired the way some of these things are being handled. But this is something that can actually turn the focus away from politics. You could play politics all you want to yeah. disaster management if and when it does happen. Not the way we all wish it would, but thank you for coming on, Suleiman Arik Babu, uh, an environmentalist, uh, taking a look at some of this. But we still do expect or do hope that perhaps someday uh, the NIMED director of weather forecasting may just come forward and uh, shed some light on some of these so that you all, or we all, can have this information that we can use to save ourselves of any, as they say, unforeseen circumstances.